Hi everyone, I'm Kseni and welcome to today's Qigong practice. I've asked you guys on my YouTube channel to help me plan the next video. Thank you very much to everyone who voted and I've checked over the weekend, although the results were really close, many of you asked to do the lower back and spine flow. So in this video, we're going to do exactly that. I've included some of my favorite exercises to help us stretch and strengthen the muscles of the back, release the tension if you have any, and loosen up a little bit. Let's begin. So let's begin. Stand up nice and tall. Relax your whole body. Soften your knees. Feel connected to the ground through your feet. Tuck your tailbone in to lengthen the spine. Keep your head upright. Relax your shoulders. Very good. And then we start with opening the chest. Inhale all the way to the top. And then exhale, soften and relax. Inhale, lift and open. Exhale, soften. Relax. One more. Inhale up. And exhale. Very good. And bring your hands underneath the abdomen. We're going to lengthen through the front. So reach up, bring your attention to the front of the body, especially the uh, belly, the chest, the front of the neck, inside of the arms and the center of the palms, the fingers. Reach up, go as high as you can. Lengthen through the front and then slowly turn your palms down. Release, relax the neck, drop your chest, open your belly. Let everything soften and relax. Very good. One more time. Go up. Lengthen through the front, stay firm on the ground, reach up all the way as high as you can and then slowly release. Notice the shift, the tension changes with relaxation. Relax the hands down and notice the sensations. Very good. Let's do one more. Go up. Press out. Lengthen. Open the chest. Lift the shoulders up. Tense the whole upper body and then soften. Relax. And simply enjoy the sensation. Very good. Should feel nice and warm here already. So move your hands to the side. We're going to do the same, but we're going to lift a big cloud right above your head, lengthening through the spine, the shoulders, the outside of the arm. So reaching up and then release. Relax your shoulders, your elbows, your fingers all the way down. Let everything just soften. Go up again. So keep your breath natural. Always inhaling, always exhaling. So don't hold your breath or lock it. You want to keep it flowing, keep it soft. Focusing, lengthening through the crown of the head, back of the neck your spine nice and long and then release and melt down. Now it's like a big wave of relaxation washing over you. Let's do one more here. Go up. First with tense. Reach up. Stretch or lengthen your body like a rubber all the way up and then release and let it relax. Mm. 
Notice the neck and shoulders, down your back, into the lower back, even your hips, the inside, the outside of the arms, the chest, and the abdomen. Very good. Then make your hands into loose fist, and we're going to twist and turn. So keep your feet firm on the ground. Feel connected. It's like a root system of the tree. The goal is to have a powerful, strong foundation and a very flexible, soft and supple upper body. So here, you want to feel just that. You want to stay connected to the ground and relax the upper body. So when you turn, also turn your hips a little bit as, uh, as far as you feel comfortable. Just turn in, keep them soft, keep them loose. Relax the muscles of the back, soften the tailbone is down. And begin noticing the sensation inside. So in Qigong, it's all about movement, mind and breath. So let's take a couple of nice inhales. Inhale in and then exhale. Relax even more. Inhale and exhale. Last one, inhale. And soft and let it all out. Very good. Slow down. Come back to center. Relax for a second and notice how your body feels. Notice your feet, and your ankles, your knees, your thighs, your hips. Notice the sensation in your arms. Very good. Let's take a nice deep inhale here. Open the entire body, reach up and then soften, exhale. Inhale, open and then exhale, relax and let go. One more, go up and relax. Very good. Then from here, we're going to sink down into the chair pose, but keeping our feet about shoulder width apart. So sink down, bend your knees, feel your thighs, activate those muscles, and then keep your lower back nice and relaxed. So you want to use again the powerful, the strength of your legs to support your body weight. Relax the spine, relax the tailbone. Feel the connection, feel the grounding and then what we're going to do we're going to raise up like a flower grow through the mud all the way up lengthen our spine as if someone's pulling us up all the way to the sky maybe chin to the chest or lengthen through the back and then soften let it all relax again sinking back down inhale travel through the spine reach up lengthen then soften, go down again. Let's add the breathing. We're going to inhale, sending our breath all the way up to the crown of the head. And then exhale, soften, send it back down to your feet. Like a little mind trick. Inhale, reach up, feel that power, raise up. Exhale, soften, send it back down. Inhale up through the spine to the top of the head and exhale, soften. Again, noticing 
the breath, noticing the sensations, using our mind to create flow. Inhale up. And exhale, soften. Very good. And then from here, we're going to raise up and then send the weight up the spine all the way to the top of the head. Then move the shoulders forward and sink back down. Inhale up. Exhale. Inhale up. And exhale. Inhale. So bring your attention to the spine, the bottom of your torso, the hips. Everything is nice and relaxed. Go up and down. Again, remain in that connection to the ground. A strong foundation in our legs. And that very supple and fluid spine and the upper back. There's no tension, no straining, just enjoying the flow. Let your arms naturally follow the body. So the movement begins in your feet, travels up the spine, and then naturally finishes off like a big wave. Think about water. It's very fluid. The element that can adjust to anything and go anywhere. So you want to keep that suppleness and fluidity in your body. Go up. Down. Up. And down. Very good. Let's do a couple more. It helps to really warm up the back and strengthen. So you seem like you're not doing much, but engaging the whole body, sending the blood and the energy up the spine and back down. So good for circulation and good for relaxation as well. Very good. Last one. Up and soften. Relax. Take a quick mental note how your body feels, especially your spine, the hips and the legs. Become more aware of the physical body. Let's take a nice deep inhale here. Again, open. And then soft and relax. Inhale up. Exhale down. Inhale up. And exhale. Very good. And next, bring your feet together. So we're going to focus primarily on the lower back. We want to uh, squeeze a little bit and then relax. It's all about tension and relaxation. So bring your attention to the lower back, feet uh, together. We're going to sink down, again, strong foundation here, but around our back, it's almost like a dragon. So around your back, so you can feel like your little spine, so like a dragon back. Chin to the chest, round the neck as well. So you're resting here comfortably as much as you can be. And then we're going to inhale, raise up, and arch into a small back bend. So open the chest, look up, squeeze the lower back. Then soften, sink down, and around your back, relax. Inhale up. Just a gentle pinch, no further than a comfortable point. Exhale, relax. Inhale, open. 
Squeeze your glutes, look up, arch your back, soften. I'm going to stay here for better view. So we open and then we release around the lower back, the upper back, the neck, the shoulders. Go up and back down. Inhale, open. Exhale, round. Paying attention to the lower back. Squeeze. Last one here. Relax. And this time, just relax the hand by the side. And come. Maybe step aside a little bit. Notice how your lower back feels. Bring your mind, bring your attention to that area. Very good. Then the next, if you want, keep your feet together. That's a little bit more challenging. What we're going to do is we're going to swing the hands to the side, up above the head, and lean. We want to open the side of the body. At the same time, move the upper back and the neck. Mm -hmm. Just enough for you to the comfortable position. Go down. Here, bend the knees, and just keep it more interesting. Turn, and like a tree in the wind. Very flexible and supple. Strong foundation. And then, lean. Very good, go down. Let's add the breathing. Inhale. And lean, exhale, and soften. Inhale, lean, exhale, soften. We do one more on each side. Inhale, lean, exhale. One more. Inhale. And exhale. Just lower your hands down. Stay in this position. And relax by the side. Again, take a notice how your body feels. The shoulders, down the back. Maybe even the sides. Well, the sides, you should feel them now a bit more. A bit more aware of that body part. Very good. And then, if your legs are doing okay, you can stay here. If not, just give them a little shake to the side. Otherwise, we're going to continue. We're going to sink down. Again, using the strength of the legs, not the lower back. So, really find kind of that balance between the two. And then bring your hands right here. Something like you're holding a big ball in front of you. And then we're going to turn, but Twisting primarily with the upper back. So turn, so your shoulders pulling you to the side as far as you can, comfortably. Then release, roll back, stay with me and turn to the other side. Go down, go back, excuse me, and raise up, lower your hands. Let them rest, relax your legs. Very good. Then sink back down again. Nice round shoulders. Relax lower back. And let's do it one more time. So we're going to turn. Pull in with the upper back. Release. It's a fantastic exercise. If you have like a laptop neck and shoulders, that's a good stretch. Release. And lower the hands down. Notice how you feel. The whole body is nice and open. You should feel warm, relaxed, and energized. Step out to the side. Let's take a nice big inhale. And exhale. Inhale. And exhale. 
Inhale and exhale. Very good. Relax the hands at the side. And then from here, we're just going to do a few hip rotation. So your lower back should feel nice and relaxed. Bring your attention to your hips. Notice how they feel. Notice how they're doing. If there's any tension or tightness, slow down and just gently massage the muscles around and underneath, loosening up, releasing every muscle. Feel nice and a bit more relaxed, a bit more soft. Very good. Then come back to center, pause, and we're going to roll in the opposite direction. So just a couple of those to really massage the area. Make sure the blood is flowing up and down. Make sure the blood can travel freely up and down the legs and the spine. Okay, very good. Last two. And slow down. Come back to center. Relax. Relax the lower back. Soften your knees. Relax your hips. And we're going to take a nice deep inhale. All the way up. And then send your breath like a refreshing waterfall all the way down to your feet. Again, open, lift and expanding. And then sending it down in the center of the body, washing away. One more time, go up. And down. And then to finish today's routine, turn your hands facing each other. It's almost like you're holding a big ball in front of your belly. Soften your knees, feel connected to the ground again. And we're going to open the hands, deepen our breath. So your belly maybe expand a little bit. And then go down, move the belly in and exhale. Inhale, stand up, open the hands, Take a nice deep inhale all the way to your belly. Then exhale. Inhale. Then exhale. Focusing on the abdomen. Focusing on the space between your hands. You should feel nice and warm. Like a sense of kind of comfort and fullness. Just the warmth. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Open. Exhale. Inhale. Open. Exhale. Two more. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale. And exhale down. Very good. Open your hands and just place them on the uh, lower abdomen. Close your eyes. Notice how your body feels. 
Notice the warmth underneath your hands. It warms up the entire belly, the entire abdominal area. Relax the neck and shoulders. Tailbone down, soften your hips. And just enjoy this moment. If you feel good, I hope you feel good. Relaxed and energized. Free. There's space between the joints, there's space in your spine, in your hips, in your knees. Notice the internal movement, the internal dynamics. Very good. Open your eyes and relax your hands. Thank you very much for joining me. I really hope you enjoyed this routine. So let me know how it goes in the comments below. Enjoy the rest of your day and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.